Crimson Invasion releases on November 3rd and to celebrate I'd like to give away a sealed Crimson Invasion booster box. To enter this giveaway all you need to do is like the video you're watching, comment down below the hashtag Amity Invasion and subscribe to the channel. Like and comment on every video I upload until November 30th to increase your chances of winning. Good luck everyone! What's cracking YouTube? My name's Brody and welcome to another Pokemon trading card game opening and today we are back with another versus on the channel. This time it's a bit more of an exciting versus so just recently on the channel I did a $5 scratchy versus a flash fire booster pack but today we're doing something a little bit more we've got a giratina like blister pack of sorts i don't exactly know what one what that one's called but we also have two bonus booster packs as well to give it like roughly like a 20 dollar value or slightly more and then we've got the $20 Scratchy. So you guys can see at the top there, there is the Instant Millionaires Club Scratchy. This thing has like been staring at me, staring at me for so long. I'm, I'm like a Scratchy addict, but at the same time, I'm not. I'm only addicted when I actually buy them. So like I've had this on hand and I've just been like holding it like, oh, I want to scratch it so bad. So we're going to scratch it today finally and um, see what it has in store for us and see what these boost packs have in store for us today as well. So if you guys are keen for today's opening scratch it be sure to drop a like down below and subscribe if you're new to the channel but uh, with that said we're going to crack into the booster packs first this time and then do the scratchy because i remember from last time the scratchy scratchings made a little bit of a mess on the on the play mat and things yeah things got a little bit messy so let's go so we got two uh, phantom forces and a guardians rising booster pack and then we've got steam siege evolutions and fates collider with the giratina which i think by the looks of it there you guys can see i think it's going to be damage which is ki like, which kind of sucks so let's open this one up and see oh there's the back for those guys who want to pause and have a read of that one as well I haven't actually opened this one on the channel before. I've kind of like avoided opening blisters, like three pack bl blisters, because they're just like, they're somewhat expensive here in Australia. And at the same time, you just don't get like the craziest of pulls from them as well. And I can already see the damage. Oh, that sucks so much. That's so gross. But there is the code for the undamaged Giratina on TCGO. First in best dress on that one. So if you, you guys want to be first in best for the uh, best dress for the codes, be sure to hit the bell next to the subscribe button to be notified whenever I upload. But there's a cool looking Primal Kyogre coin. I like that one. We could use the coin to uh, scratch the scratchy. <laughs> we, we actually really could. I do have the lucky one cent piece here today. The little lucky Australian old school one cent piece. Usually comes through for us. It didn't last time, but um, uh, I won't spoil too, too much about that video. But yo, that's so bad. That's so badly damaged. But there is the Giratina. It's got 130 HP with the ability Devour Light and Shadow Claw. It says discard a random card from your opponent's hand. Oh, that's so damaged. It's gross. That's why I chose to open this blister anyway. Like I kind of just happened I just happened to notice that it was like kind of kind of boshed up. But anyways. So here <laughs> I'm so I'm so depressed about that. I just wanted like wanted it to surprise me and not be damaged. But um here's our pack. So let's go. Fates, Steam Siege, Fates Collide, Evolutions, Guiding Rising, then Phantom Forces. Alrighty, let's go finally. Let's crack into these packs and see what we can get today. Let's knock it down into card opening mode. There we go. Alrighty. And the opening begins finally. Sorry about that. It kind of takes a little bit a little bit longer to introduce these weirder openings here that I don't usually do too often. So what are we doing? Three and two because we're not doing Sun and Moon. Alright. Okay, Steam Siege, what do you have for us today? So we've got a Mantine, Clink, Ponyta, a Ponyard, Oshawa, Clef Key, Greedy Dice, Skiploom, a Joltic, Reverse Holo Common, and just a Toxicroak, regular rare. Okay, so we'll throw the, throw the Reverse Holo just at the back there. Um, Fates Collide is up next, let's go. Lift it up just so you guys, so it doesn't spoil anything. If it's facing, I can't even tell what way it's going to be facing these days. The codes, they're just like in completely randomly. I don't know if it means anything, if it means like that it's a different print of sorts, but yeah. So we got a Spoink, Coughing, Cottony, a Weezing, Fairy Garden, Whimsicott, Old Amber Aerodactyl, Reverse Holo Uncommon, with a Lucario Holo. Nice. That is something. That is something there. 110 HP with the uh, epic looking... Uh, 
Alakazam in the background there. Always love that. With Vacuum Wave and Fight Alone. Nice. That can go chill up the back there. Evolutions. Hopefully, we can get something like really hype to like <laughs> put up a bit of a fight against this um this scratchy because I got I have a really I've always since I bought this scratchy I've had a really good feeling about it. I feel as if there was just going to be something like a nice win, a nice win on this scratchy. So we'll see, we will see. So we got a Volpix here, a Fire Energy, Voltorb, Charmander, Diglett, v uh, Venusaur, Spirit Link. Full heal, Machoke, Raichu, Reverse Holo Rare, nice, and a Mega Venusaur EX, yo, alright, so things are stepping up here, it's got 230 HP with Crisis Vine, yo, that was a really good pack, the Raichu, re the, the Reverse Holo looks so good, I don't know what it is about them, but they just look so good, so let's throw that up the back, so we got some value finally forming, finally forming up the back there. Alrighty, Guardians Rising is up next. I haven't really figured out a way to like judge um, the price wise. So the more more of these I do, uh, the better I will be at being able to kind of compare the two in the verses of sorts. So uh, today should be a, a good test, a good test. So we got a Bell Sprout, Cottony. It's gonna gonna kind of be like based on pricing so basically if a card's worth for example the mega venusaur it might, might be worth like four dollars or something like that oh we got a choice band that'll add to the total um it can kind of yeah all add together to hopefully beat the scratchy but we got a beldum there just a reverse holo common with a gothitelle a regular rare okay please fingers crossed can we get a mega gengar secret rare out of one random pack of phantom forces Come on, come on. White code means nothing. Old set. Old set. But yeah, hopefully you guys have enjoyed today's opening so far. If you have, be sure to drop a like down below. But done, let's go. So we got a Rog and Roller, Fletchling, a Muna, Gumi, Litleo, Furfru, Firo, a Lysander's Trump card, Lee Vanny, which is a reverse holo rare, and a Gudra holo all right nice we got another holo so that kind of like ups the total a little bit but not not the uh kind of bump that we're looking for to really put up a bit of a fight here today but it's got 140 hp with the ability slip trip and dragon pulse nice nice so both of our like pu like pull packs other than the fates collide one um had a reverse holo rare and then a holo rare but it is time it is time for the the instant billionaire, uh, instant billion, <laughs> instant millionaires club, billionaire would be insane. Um, it says two top prizes of one million dollars. Um, you've got like game one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then two extra games and a multiplier panel. Okay, this is interesting. I've never done one of these before, so excuse me while I'm really slow at this. But um, let's have a look at the how to play section here. It says scratch each game panel. Find the exact same symbol three times in a single game to win the corresponding prize shown for that game. Um, so I need to find it three times. Okay, so we'll start off with game one and game two and so game one to four is all the same. So they're all the same. Let's see if we can do it. Let's go. Um, I'll see if I can get like a nice angle for you guys. Something like, something like that. Alrighty, so let's do a quick... Just give me half a second here while I do a little bit of maintenance here and move all of the bulk out of the way because this is going to get messy very quickly. Very, very quickly. Okay. So let's go. Hopefully, you guys can see that all right. So we've got game number one here. So let's have a look at the prize $1,000. Prize on game two, 100. Game three, 200 uh 250 yeah 250 and then just 50 so the chances of us winning out of these games i highly doubt it but let's go game four what do we got car scale scale so you guys can see that there nothing what do we got here we got What's well, not scratching as well as what I want it to, but we got two boats there. 
and a perfume. So nothing there. Game two. What do we got? Um, I can't even tell what it is. So what's that like a piece of uh, a bullion? I'm guessing that's like a block of gold, a globe and a coffee. Oh, it's gonna get messy real quick. Uh, <laughs> game one. What do we got? Coffee. Helicopter and a plane. So nothing there. So as I thought, as I thought, let me bang that off and show you guys here. Nothing there. So we got the plane, helicopter, coffee for a thousand. Yeah, that's expected. Alrighty, moving on to game number five. Let's have a have a look see here on the back. Um, game number five. Scratch the game panel. Find the exact same symbol three times in the game panel to win the corresponding prize for that game panel. So it's the same thing again. It could have just said same as game one, <laughs> except it's slightly different shape. But um, so we'll scratch the prize and then we'll just like go ham and scratch the whole thing. So what's our prize? Our prize is just a ooh, fifty dollars. Okay, so that seems like reachable. So let's go straight up the top. What do we got? We have a bracelet and two martinis and. Come on, give us the goods. No, it couldn't do it. <laughs> it's just a, a watch, a bike, and a house. Okay. Alrighty. Next game. What do we got? Game number six. So we got our lucky numbers and my numbers. Okay, so I'm guessing basically what you're going to have to do is scratch your lucky numbers. And if you find the uh, lucky number in the game panel, you'll win the dollar value underneath the symbol in the, or the number in the game panel, I'm guessing. But let's, ha let's have a look. Game number six. So scratch the lucky numbers and your numbers. Exactly match any of the eight lucky numbers to any of the 12 your numbers in uh, to win the, the prize shown for you that your number so that's so confusing <laughs> that's so confusing but yeah basically it was like a, like how I said um, so I'm gonna just kind of turn this sideways and let's scratch our lucky numbers let's see if I can like scratch it relatively like nicely okay so there is the lucky numbers so what do we have what do we have what do we have so we've got 16, 33, 27, 36, 21, 19, 38, and 57. Okay. Definitely none of them are looking pretty lucky to me anyway. So let's go. Let's go ham and let's see. One at a time. Actually, let's go one at a time. What do we got? 24. So what was that? For $1,000, 24. Do we have a 24? No, we don't. Oh, gross. Gross. Okay, under that, what do we got? We have, for the big million dollars, right there, we have 44. I got a 33. I got nothing in the 40s. Damn, looks like I'm not a millionaire today, you guys. <laughs> Next one. What do we have? We have, for $500, we have number 17. Oh, you're teasing me. We got a 16 there and a 19, but no 17. Alrighty, next one. Oh, do we have a lucky 35 for $20 to make the money back for the ticket? No, they tease me with the 36. I got a 33 and a 36, but no 35. How disappointing. Alrighty, next one. For $30, stepping things up here, we have a 39. Do we have a 39? No, we don't. We have a 38. That's that's teasing me once again. I'm, I'm not liking this scratchy right now. This is really like Really upsetting. We got no nothing in the 40s once again, like I said just before so no hundred dollar there next one For five hundred dollars. Do we have a 22? 22 going once going twice. No, we don't we have a 21. How convenient <laughs> How convenient 14. No, we don't have a 14. I know that for sure. We've only got 19 and 16 in the teens. Oh dear, this is getting messy real quick. Let me just kind of see if I can like scrape this. Up. No, it's 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 gone. It's too far gone, guys. I have to clean that up real good after the after the opening and scratch it. All right, let's just smash through these final numbers and go through go through them. So two at a time. What do we got? We've got 
23 and 59. Do we have a 23 or a 59? We got a 57 and a 21, but no, we don't. Last two. What do we have? A 55 and a 26. And we don't, we've got a 27, no 26. And we've got a 57, not a 55. So looks like we didn't win on that game either. <laughs> which is which is convenient, but we have game number seven here. So what is game number seven? Game number seven says Double digit numbers appearing in the game panels cannot be separated 13 matches 13 cannot be separated into one and three. Okay So I'm guessing you find like The numbers in something okay that didn't really like help but let's just scratch it and see um, oh, okay, so it's just straight up dollar values. So we got a hundred thirty and two fifty Just there. Whoops. That wasn't even on camera, but um, there you go. And then last three numbers. What do we have? 150 and 250 So nothing there couldn't find oh So close so close, but yet so far how convenient anyways <laughs> moving on to the extra games I, I don't think we want we won there so. I don't remember reading anything weird. Um, game number six. Was that six? No, that was seven. Yeah, that was seven. Okay. I know, weird. Uh, let's go on to the extra games, I, I think. I think we're up to the extra games. Okay. So let's go extra, extra, extra. Extra game number one. Sorry, I can't speak. Right, the, if we find the cash symbol, you win hundred dollars. So, I highly doubt, doubt we're gonna win in the extra game, but it's it's worth a hit. It's it's worth a hit. So, what do we got? A camera, and come on, cash. No, just a ring. So nothing there on the ticket. So it looks like uh, the trading card game opening is a victor once again. I don't think there's anything there. So what's the the multiplier panel? What was that supposed to do? Times one. Um, so I just... Oh, I'm guessing that's if you win something. It, like, multiplies your total, like, winnings. I think that's what it was saying somewhere on here. Anyway. So that's the $20 scratchy. So we got we got ripped off today. Dudded. Loser, loser, loser. Winner, winner, winner. All the TCG. Oh, there's so much stuff everywhere. But anyways, let's, let's wrap things up here. I'll just kind of tilt this up this way so I don't get anything anywhere but there's your scratchy there's your loser loser scratchy there's the winnings from today's opening so i definitely think that uh the trading card game opening was a success and that scratchy was really fun <laughs> anyways i've never done one of those so that that was really quite exciting so if you guys did enjoy today's opening scratch it versus be sure to drop a like down below subscribe if you're new to, new to the channel and let me know in the comment section below if you guys enjoyed this and would like to see me do this more on the channel but I'm going to wrap things up there. It has been a long video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. But with that said, I'm going to get up out of here. Thanks for watching today's opening. I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. Peace.